I'm Tom Thomas and I went to Wancliffe Side Primary School. I'm Ibrahim, I came from Marcliffe School. Um, beef, uh, when I got my place in Bradfield I was really excited because um, I was uh, obviously in year six, we've been doing a lot of progress up to all the sats and stuff and when we got this news it was like we were, everyone was really excited and raring to go. Like when we got our information, like it was a long time, but we got information about our teachers and about the school and everywhere. So we knew a lot of information about school. Uh, our form teachers sent us a little bit of like an information text just about his hobbies and interests and what he likes to do in his spare time. I know my tutor teachers likes PE because he told us when we started the school. Uh, when coronavirus halted all the things that we were doing in year six, uh, we, everyone started worrying about not knowing what we were going to do at Bradfield and if there was even going to be a transition stay or, any, or anything. And everyone was just really panicking. In the transition day, um, like we did like, we went to different classes but the teacher told us where to go and like the lessons were fun and we had to do quizzes and like challenging stuff. Um, when we got here on the first day I remember I was in the car with my mum and my brother and they were all like oh calm down and I was really really scared and nervous about moving around and all the homework and getting told off and all of that but it it was the teachers and all the staff and the kids welcomed us really, really well. And now, like three weeks on, it's like we've never not been here. In the first week, we had more tutor time because we had to know each other. And lots of teachers were like, like letting us know each other. Like, and then when you get lost in the school, you like, I've lost, I've got lost like 10 times, but the teach, I went to a teacher and they helped me a lot to get to progress. It really helped that I had an older brother in Bradfield because he was really supportive and he was five weeks before we actually went, he was just telling me all about it and he really, it really helped me. When I came here, I didn't know anyone, but I challenged myself, and now I know ev everybody in the school. Hi, welcome to Bradfield School. I'm Mrs Lofthouse. I'm currently the head of Year 7, and over the last two years, I've worked on transition with our primary schools. Um, this is a really, really exciting time for both parents and students, and I really thank you for having a look at these virtual online sessions to enable you to get to know a little bit more about the school and the process we go through before your child comes to us in September. So March 1st is the day when you'll find out where your child is going to um, their secondary school. From that date, Bradfield work with the primary. So every single primary. This year we've had 16 primary schools um, that we've worked with to enable a smooth transition. So my job, like I said, is to work with the feeder primary schools to ensure that smooth transition. So from March the 1st onwards, we meet either virtually as we have done last year or the year before, we go into primary schools and meet the teacher while another member of staff meets the students that are coming to us. We try and get as much information as possible um, about your child before they come to Bradfield School. This helps us to get a sense of where they are currently, at, both in times of both in terms of academic progress and pastorally as well. So my job is to try and marry those two things up together so your child has a fantastic start to Bradfield School. Our process, once we've got all this information, is to put your child in a form. They will meet the form teacher before coming up to Bradfield School, again to just ease that transition and any worries that might happen over the summer holidays. We have a dedicated email address that is transition at bradfield.sheffield.sch that if there's any issues over the summer holidays or before the summer holidays we can, we can get in touch with you and vice versa. 
it's really important at this time that we ensure that smooth transition for the development of your child. So as well as me working with the primary schools, we also involve the SENCO at Bradfield School and the SENCO at the primaries and also the safeguarding team as well. What is evident from our two students in Year 7 that just spoke to you, um, they've made fantastic progress as they've been here. They've felt, felt really, really supported by both staff and students. We have a very robust um, form tutor time where in Year 7 we talk a lot about strengths and qualities and how could they can develop as people. We also do a lot of work on communication because we're very eager for our Year 7 students to all know each other and get to know each other really, really well. So this aids the five years that they will spend with us at Bradfield. So as I said, my job as Head of Year 7 is to make sure the academic progress and the pastoral side is, is up and running and it fully supports each other. Um, in addition, I work with a dedicated pupil support officer which is Mr Carrington and he will go on about his role a little bit um, later in further detail. So I hope this has given you a bit of an insight into what my role is. Um, we're definitely here to support your child moving to Bradfield. So I look forward to working with you in the near future. Thank you. Hello, I'm Mr Carrington. I am the Year 7 Pupil Support Officer. Um, I look after Year 7 once I arrive up at Bradfield School. Part of my job is to liaise with primary schools um, and discuss obviously with them the needs of the pupils coming up. Uh, and then. Part of my uh, role when I'm here is I don't have a teaching timetable so I'm available obviously throughout the day to support with students. I look forward to meeting you all next year when you start uh, and I can't wait to meet you all.